As we continue to count down to Monday's eclipse, we're also talking safety and why are those special glasses so important and what you can do if you're having trouble getting your hands on them. Alexa Trishler lets us know. Solar eclipses have inspired people for hundreds of years and will continue to on April 8th. In the past, observing eclipses helped us discover the element helium and prove Einstein's theory of general relativity. So how can we check out this awesome show without hurting our eyes? Well, there are many ways to check it out safely, like specially approved solar eclipse glasses. If you do happen to have ones left over from 2017, they are still good to use as long as they're not damaged. And of course, regular sunglasses will not cut it. You will also need special lenses and filters to be able to see it safely through a camera, telescope, scope or binoculars. If you don't have official eclipse glasses or those lenses and filters for your devices, another way to check it out is to find a tree and look down at the ground. With your back to the sun, look at the shadow of the leaves from the tree. You'll be able to see the crescent shape when the partial eclipse is happening. You can also do the same thing with a kitchen utensil with holes in it like a colander. The sunlight will pass through the holes and you can see the partial eclipse while looking at the ground. If you want to get really creative, you can make a pinhole projector at home. First, you need a cardboard box like a cereal box or a shoe box. Then you need aluminum foil, a pencil, scissors, tape, a pushpin, and a white piece of paper big enough to cover the end of the box. Trace one end of the box onto the white paper. Cut it out, then place it into the same side of the box. Then cut two square holes on the opposite end of the box. Tape the middle if using a cereal box. Cover one of the square holes with aluminum foil. Tape the foil in place and use a pushpin to make a very small hole in the center of the aluminum. To use that projector, stand with your back to the sun. Then hold the large square opening up to your eye and look around until you see the sun projected on your white paper inside the box. The sunlight will shine through the tiny pinhole and cast a fantastic image on the white paper in the box. There are many other ways to check out the solar eclipse. Remember, do not ever look directly at the sun no matter what because you can do permanent damage to your eyes. We're preparing a special two-hour eclipse show. You can watch that live on WWL Plus starting at 1230. That's on Monday.